Well, I'm excited to be talking to Kelsey Ritter. She is the Senior Director, Director of Development for Omaha Home for Boys. Um, Kelsey, thank you so much for joining me today. Yeah, thanks for having me, Andy. So, I mean, I know we, we've talked a lot um, over the last, honestly, year and a half with everything of COVID and, and the pandemic about the 100th anniversary that finally, finally, we had the event um, uh, in March, correct? Correct, yes. Yeah, yeah. so, I mean, that, that was a long process. So exciting. I mean, 100 years of any nonprofit organization is so much to celebrate. Uh, but we're going to be talking here about the back to school supply drive, which is so important to um, to the people that you serve, the young people you serve um, going to college. And I want to, let's just first talk about Omaha Home for Boys and who do you serve and the mission of the organization. Yeah, for sure. So Omaha Home for Boys, as you mentioned, has been in our community for over a hundred years, which is spectacular. And we hope that we're a, you know, a, a pillar of strength in the community as well. And so yeah. each year we serve over 1300 youth and young adults, uh, just, you know, working with them on where they are and how to get to that next level. So whether it's meeting their basic needs of helping them find food and housing, or whether it is helping connect them with scholarships um, and, you know, vital documents and how they can get to that next step in their education. So we really, you know, meet them where they're at and, and just try to take them to the next level through our different programs. Yeah. So let's talk about the, the school supply drive, because I mean, it, it, in its yeah. name, the school supply drive. So we're talking about supplies for the most part. And what are what are these supplies that are needed for them to just yeah, to be get started and, and have what have the essentials that they need as they're moving on in their life? Yeah, so so the school supply drive is really aimed at high school as well as um, those young adults who are going into the next step of their education as well. Okay. So on the school supply list, you're going to see folders and notebooks and backpacks and all those regular school supplies you know you might see on that high school list um, that okay. are going to benefit kids that are you know youth that are out in the community going to the schools, but also the youth that are uh, in our programs right now going to the OHB school. So you're going to see okay. items such as those on the list. Now, you're also going to see some dorm room essentials. So for kids who are, you know, heading off into the college to college or that kind of next step in their education career, mm -hmm. um, we have some of those dorm room essentials that can just help them get started as well. And the whole goal from this is really so we can provide these youth and young adults everything, the tools that they need to be able to start their school year and feel that they're confident and productive and be able to, you know, release some of that financial burden from them as well. And so when people are looking at these supplies and thank you, I mean, I kind of mentioned college, but yes, absolutely high schoolers, um, because there, there are things that they need and they can't either afford them or their families, you know, can't afford them. And it, and it gives them the, just like you said, what they need to be successful. And so how do we, how do we get these to you is, yeah. how do we get there? How do we get well, these to you? How do you get involved? Right? Yeah. yeah. So. Yeah. Uh, you can go to ohb.org, our website, and um, we actually have a list of items on there that we're looking okay. for. And so some people choose to shop on their own and, you know, contact us and drop things off. Um, otherwise, we try to make it pretty simple and we put together an Amazon wish list. And so you can go straight on to Amazon and um, order what you need to, and they'll actually be shipped straight to us. So we try to make it as easy as, as it can be for everybody. Yeah. And I'm actually, I'm, I, I'm, I'm kind of glancing over here because I am on your your website. And one of the things about shopping on the Amazon um, wish list, especially if you if you're like a family and you want to do this together as a group, I mean, writing a check cash is always great. And mm -hmm. but this is almost something where you can get involved. And so mm -hmm. you can go through and your kids can help you pick out stuff. And it just makes it, um, I think, a little more special and also instills in them the importance of kind of that personal aspect of, mm. hey, we're buying this, you know, we're, we're, we're choosing this and selecting this for somebody that is going to make a huge difference. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. And so when people are out, you know, getting their own school supplies, they can pick up some extra and, you know, drop them off with us. We have organizations that are doing drives at their companies and then arranging a drop off date with us. So um, however anybody wants to do it, we, you know, we will find a way to get people involved for yeah. sure. Yeah. And I'm glad you mentioned that from a company aspect too, is that 
if you own a company or you're, or you're, you know, or you're working whatever for a company, this is a great initiative to have because you're collecting these items between July 22nd through August 2nd. And that's where people can either drop them off or go on Amazon or, or whatnot. Cause if you go on Amazon, you're, you don't need to drop them off, but some people actually may want to go shopping at yeah. target or Walmart or wherever um, to pick these things up. So yeah. So just adding a li- little bit to that, I'm also looking at the wish list. So it's pretty, it's pretty easy to see what you can. Um, but if you have questions, they can just get a hold of you. Yeah. Yeah, For- definitely. Say so if you go on our website, you can find our contact information, you know, items of suggested things that could be yeah. donated. Um, you know, and if you want to always, always give us a call, we're happy to yeah. answer question. So we're so thankful to Pinnacle Bank for being the sponsor of um, our back to school supply drive. Uh, So we always, you know, thank our community partners as well for everyone who's getting involved in making this possible. Yeah. Well, Kelsey, thank you so much for coming on with me. And again, this is August 22nd through, I'm sorry, July 22nd through August 2nd. And um, it's just an important way that we can get back to OHB, Omaha Home for Boys, over a hundred years of making a difference in the lives of youth um, in our community. So Kelsey, thank you once again. Yes. Thank you, Andy.